morning. I don't know why you keep sleeping on the oven hobs. I don't know why you keep doing that, Blo. Are you okay? Hey? Oh, you're getting old now, aren't you? He's getting so old. He's like, how old is he? 11? He's 11 now. He's getting old. <laughs> We've had him since he was a little baby and he's always been the cutest. He was so small that when I first got him and we were litter training him, um, he couldn't step into the litter tray because I had one of those ones with the door on, but I'd taken the door off so we'd learned how to use it without the door. And uh, it was too high for him to step in. So I had to put like a little plastic, like one of them food tubs that you get your takeaway in. I had to put one of them upside down in front of it to make him a step so we could get into it. <laughs> so cute, isn't it? So cute. Um, oh, I've been up and down this morning. I'm going to church and I know that's going to make me feel better. So I'm looking forward to it and I'm hoping it will just be uplifting. But I keep crying. I keep bursting into tears for no reason. Just, I don't know, like yesterday... Oh, I had such a nice evening. I can't even tell you what a nice evening I had. I um had pizza, not like ordered in, I cooked it from the freezer. But um I had pizza. I made myself like a little feast. I had like pizza and some chicken and I um basically I realised my daughter got um she's got Netflix but like the lowest one, it's like a five or something and you get adverts in the middle of it. But um, her boyfriend, like, stuck the Netflix on for her. So she's given me her password. And I hadn't seen Downton Abbey, the movie. I'd seen all of the series, but I've not seen either of the movies. And I realised, like, they had the second one on there for ages. They didn't have the first one. And I realised the first one was on there last night. So I literally, like, <sighs> I hate it when that happens. Um, my phone just come up, low battery. I literally, like... I put that on and I had my pizza and I sat there and I just chilled out watching this movie and just lost myself for a couple of hours in Downton Abbey and then thought about how much I would love to like live a simpler life like they had then and then started crying again so <laughs> things were going well until then um yeah so I'm all right uh the other thing is I can't do comments at the moment I'm so sorry um, things were going really, really well. Uh, I didn't have really a bad one or anything like that, but I just, because, I don't know how to put this. I'm just going to say, say it how it is. So, like, there's a lot, like I said the other day, like, there's a lot that I share on YouTube, and there's a couple of things that I don't, and that's because it's involving other people, but it's affecting me. So, you've got my side of things, pretty much, but you haven't got like the full story. So I've like when people sort of say, um, you know, certain comments, it's kind of like, look, you don't know the full story of what's going on. You will do one day. I like I will for sure tell you like exactly why and whatever, and everything will make sense. You'll all go right now, it all makes sense. It makes sense of why things were going on like that, why she was so down and stuff, but at the moment, I can't talk about that. So I've turned off comments for now because, because I can't, like, as much as I love you all so much, I really do, and I really appreciate you all for being here and all of the things you do and all of the advice you give me. But the advice you give me, a lot of it, like, it's I've already done and it's stuff that I've already tried and things like that. And some of it, like... It would work if I just had anxiety, but I don't. I have other problems. So because, you know, like the other problems are causing the anxiety to a point. So because of that, I really felt like I can't do comments right now. When I go live, when I feel ready to go live again, the comments will be on and you can sit and ask me questions. The live um, videos won't be staying up anymore because then I can kind of talk a bit more about stuff. But yeah, when I go live, the comments will be on and you can ask questions and stuff. But other than that, um, I'm not going to put them on at the moment because I am not comfortable. 
and I've got to do what makes me feel comfortable right now. Um, but I want to thank you all for like sticking with me and for following my journey. And literally, I'm going to give myself six months to change my life completely and completely feel better. And if I don't manage it in that six months, I'm going to quit YouTube because it's it's like I don't want to keep boring you with the same depression. So watch this space because I've got to change my life because I don't want to quit YouTube because I love doing it. Oh, I'm just walking to church. It's not even that far and I'm already out of breath. I only live about five or six minutes from here. Gosh. That was really good. Oh, you can't see me because of the sun. I um, just saw an old friend in there from church and he's just lovely and he's such a nice person, but I don't know if he could feel it but they had private prayer in a different room and he was like, do you want to come and have private prayer? And I just burst into tears and just, I just spilled stuff. And he was like, you need to speak to the vicar next week and tell her what's going on. And so I'm going to do that. Um, but yeah, I feel better because he laid hands on me and we done like a proper prayer and it was it was really lovely. I feel filled with the spirit because of it. So that's good, but I still feel very tearful. I'm just going to the shop now, which shouldn't really do on a Sunday, but I really I really want to go down there, so I'm going to. Um, I'm just doing things that make me feel okay at the moment. In my PJs, in my happy place. It's been, it's been a weird day, but it's been weird. But um, I don't know. It's just, it's just that like at the moment, stuff's uncomfortable, <sighs> and I'm tired. And I feel like I'm getting, I feel like I'm getting a bad tooth. I really hope not, because I cannot afford to have a bad tooth. Um, yeah, things have been really uncomfortable, and, like, I know they're going to get better, but I've got to really work hard at it, and I feel like I'm getting a lot stronger, and church was really helpful today. So I'm just going to continue to go, and I'm going to speak to the vicar this week and explain, like, really in depth what's going on and stuff like that. And yeah, I've got a couple of night days out this week um, where I'm going to see family. So that'll really cheer me up, um, you know, and I'm, I'm excited about that as well. So, yeah, I'm just going to see how this week goes. But um, I, again, thanks for watching. And obviously, like I know I've turned the comments off again, but I just can't cope with it at the moment. So you'll understand. I know you will. Um, and I will see you on the next one.